um, an international scout, Grandma Leary, um, about eight years ago. He, uh, over in uh, Edinburgh, the leaders led the team in singles and uh, pitch and sing for that. Um, it's a pretty big deal over in the UK. And we just kind of started talking about baseball, and he, he uh, kind of has an affinity for um, the States with the Rangers right now. And he's a could say an international scout with him, but uh, he just wanted to be able to come out and give kind of a UK perspective to you guys, and uh, I think it'd be something really uh, important for us to be able to hear. So, without further ado, uh, this is uh, Grandma Leary, guys. Thank you. Thank you. you know, it, first of all, it's a, it's just brilliant coaches. Uh, that might be it. It's just great. It's, uh, it's quite a bit of uh, 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 Just thanks so much, yeah. Right. Freaking Bill. Can you say, uh, can you cuss out here? Is it not polite to cuss? Um, go ahead. It's, I want to be, I don't want a cultural divide. Go ahead and do it. Right. How are you guys doing today, eh? Uh, yeah. Anybody been to Scotland? Hey, yeah. yeah, been to London. Yeah. Right. What do you think of London? Yeah. Quite nice, eh? Right. It's, it's just great. Again, thanks, Sid. Uh, you, you guys give a round of applause to the Texas. It's quite an honour, even though I work with the Rangers, and they, I find they think quite highly of my uh, my work. It's uh, it's just proud to come to the States, you know. You got a chance to speak with the kids, right? And uh, so part of what I like to do, uh, I like to talk about it here, and I bring it back with me, right? Uh, I like to talk about it a lot, but I like to talk also about the team uh, chemistry, right? How you play as a team, right? Is that good? Is that a good topic for you? Right. I gotta tell you a story about uh, one of my games not long ago. Right, I got in the box and uh, I got yeah, it's me. I was talking to take walks of fastball. Down the middle of the play here with me. I learned something new, you might try this pitch, you might try it for the Rocky three. But if you get on both tip both your tip your tip twos. And you get the bat pointed to the pitcher, it's quite intimidating. <laughs> right? It's a good to settle down. Does that make sense? Uh, so before I get going, just got one question for you. Yeah, if you've got uh, somewhere between a, uh, like, I don't know, like a Braving Sierra and a bit of a ruin there, uh, if you've got, uh, I don't know, two or three, what would you think uh, if it was up to you? Would you like, is it, is it no doubt about it? What would you think, eh? Like, what would you think? Oh, sorry, I thought you could hear it. You're just stretching, huh? Um, no. Like, you mean, I'm still trying to decide. Oh, right, okay. Yeah. So let me, I can straight away. I'm a different sort, I'm a different sort, yeah? So if they, look, if you, if there's a place here and there's no doubt against the pitcher and he's coming in, what would you think is this point of thing that uh, you wouldn't really know what to do in that sense? What would you do? <laughs> right? Guys, we were just talking about this. Joe, this is the big thing that we keep hammering on right now. Let's go. Peace, Joe. Right, Joe, so if... Right, let me just play it. It's a bit simpler. So if the... Like, if there's all that I do uh, against the uh, particular uh, game, there's no two or three, right? Would you, what would you think if, uh, if it was not the, the same time strategy-wise? It's a strategy, right? Yes. Right, what would you think? What would you do? <coughs> Yeah. yeah, right. Uh, what would your process be? Uh, hitting wise? Yeah. Um, the aggressive early in the count. Okay. Have we got a pivot? Right, right. What would you do? In that same situation, against a team like that, you know, it's not just what they Hold on, Blake, this just happened to you. You answer that. Hey guys, come on, keep it down. Guys, this, is, this is serious stuff. This is exactly what we were talking about when we take first pitch and second pitch for a strike for a fastball, and we're always looking for that two strike ball to hit out of the ballpark. Okay, oh, pitchers. Oh, I try to get the uh, hitter to swing. 
throw. Right. I try. I would not throw a pitch to the get in. Great. In the case, like sometimes with me, if I'm, uh, I feel deep, right? I, it's not quite the, it's not quite the city heat, uh, like the sheep's heat, like the, and a place called the sheep's heat, right? <laughs> and that's the way I'm trying to get the new mark, like, you know, like the sheep's heat in is kind of a, a, it's kind of a bit around it, right? So what would you do in that case? I'm confused. <laughs> what would you do? I mean, I, I, I would take those first two strikes. You would. You're telling Joe. Graham, if we, if we have a second, could you explain to these guys a little bit more, because it's obviously a lot more in the UK than here, but um, when we're talking about gibberish on the field, how we go ahead and address that with our um, with our approaches. <laughs> yeah. Um. <laughs> it's kind of like if um, if I was going to go left-handed. This is you, Joe. You're left-handed. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. I kind of go That's to fine. you know. Better, you guys don't know Rod Carew. Rod Carew used to do this, Rod right? <laughs> right. So I go Rod Carew. <laughs> Right here is a uh, Billy Barty, Billy Barty, <laughs> and then in the UK we had a uh, we had this uh, this block, oh, this block named Timmy, <laughs> <laughs> and the gibberish, right? So he said gibberish. We do the gibberish as well, right? We do the gibberish as well, like two or three. There's no dude. Can we get that on the backside care of the four, right? Yeah. Right, we carried fours, but it just depends who's in tune. <laughs> like, if you want to talk about books, okay. like what kind of books you want to talk it's, If you want to talk about books, it's great. Yeah. Right. Perfect. Any questions? Coaches, yeah. Any input, coaches? No, I think that was good. I mean, we've been trying to tell our guys about the ship she needs. <laughs> <laughs> it's quite good, actually. So I'm going to uh, give you my, my contact information so we can talk about hitting, right? So, um, Coach will get you the information. I just have one more thing for you. Is that okay? We have time? One yeah, more thing? Time. Yeah, one more. Great. So, uh, about a... The record it's, it's kind of the grand finale, if you will, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And you never like to leave the students in a, in a way that they, that you know. <laughs> Hi, there he is. All right. Right. I just got it. Uh, right, so uh, <laughs> right. Thanks, okay. Hey, thank guys, you. Grandma Larry. <laughs> <laughs>